citation for exceptionally meritorious conduct in the performance of outstanding service while serving as Congressional Liaison, Office of Legislative Affairs, Global Force Management Section Head, Current Operations Branch Head, and Service Planner, Joint Staff Branch, Plans, Policies, and Operations. Headquarters Marine Corps, Washington, D.C., from June 2017 to June 2024. During this period, Colonel Wilson performed his demanding duties in an exemplary and highly professional manner. He expertly represented the Marine Corps and its equities in engagements with members of Congress, as well as personal and professional staff members on multiple U.S. House and Senate committees. He adroitly managed the Marine Corps' contribution to the Global Force Management Board process for four consecutive years, ensuring that all service equities and risks were well articulated to the Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff and the Secretary of Defense. Colonel Wilson demonstrated steadfast leadership, judgment, and organizational skill as he led an organizational realignment which recaptured all Marine Corps Global Force Management functions across multiple locations. Colonel Wilson's superior performance of duties culminated his 26 years of honorable and dedicated military service. Colonel Wilson's bold leadership, wise judgment, and complete dedication to duty reflected great credit upon him and were in keeping with the highest traditions of the Marine Corps and the United States Naval Service. For the President, signed Eric M. Smith, General, U.S. Marine Corps, Commandant of the Marine Corps. Retirement <coughs> from Commandant of the Marine Corps to Colonel Richard W. Wilson, United States Marine Corps. Subject, release from active duty and transfer to the retired list. On 1 September 2024, you will transfer to the Marine Corps officer's retired list. At 2359 on 31 August 2024, you will detach from your present duty station and be released from active duty. As of 1 September 2024, you will complete 26 years and 6 months of active service. Ladies and gentlemen, please be seated.